internet can hold out for more than two seconds, that'd be great. That would be lovely. Be very appreciative. Yeah, just just a little bit. Just a touch. Just a touch appreciative. That's all. There we go. It's not my fault, I'm telling you. Yeah, it should be fine. All right, and I, I, I did test the thing too. If the PI is bugged out like that with the with the mastery's recoil, it's it's actually not giving you the attack bonus either. Crap. Anyway. Um. So lovely. They they definitely need to fix that. And as I was saying, I don't know if it caught before the stream like died on me. Um, that needs to get fixed before the free mastery stuff goes away. And if they don't, like it needs to they need to extend the free mastery changes until it is fixed because that is really really bad. Uh, and quite frustrating. Really, really bad. Connection's going terrible, uh, Nugget. It's, it's not great. I've already had a nine minute stream end and another one that lasted all of 30 seconds. So, uh, let's, let's cross our fingers and hopefully this one, uh, this one holds out for the day. So, cause that would be great. That would be lovely. Cause so far we ain't having no luck. Yeah, well, let's let's hope so. Let's hope so. Uh, it's just uh, I mean, who who could have guessed that master loadouts would have been bugged though when they came out came out like. Most people probably like. So I, I think most people suspected like something was not going to be working right with them. Um. To I think probably no one's surprise because I they can never have anything new released that doesn't have some kind of issue come up with it. So, hopefully. When they they should be back from their vacations and they haven't actually posted anything in the forum today, did they? Hmm. Not as far as I can see. Zoda who who was up? So ho hopefully it's addressed and fixed and taken care of sooner rather than later because it's like the point of of like the thing is is so we can swap back and forth if swapping back and forth breaks it like it's no bueno Rocket League nice Uh 
We just chillin'. Nice. Restarting also fixes it? Well, that probably would have been faster than re respecking all of the darn masteries. Either way, it it's, needs to be addressed and fixed. You have to if you have to restart the game every time you switch your mastery loadout, like that's busted <laughs> and on kabam to fix. Oh, I'm gonna seriously consider Spider Punk because he looks fun as all get out. Um. But as of right now, I don't in general do do champ grants, so we'll we'll see what I end up doing. Well, what's up, Redwood? Clap. Because switching it back to my recoil deck, or recoil loadout, like, not only does it screw with the PIs, it actually doesn't give you the attack bonus either. So, like, the masteries are, like, there, like, so you're taking your bleed and poison, but, like, you aren't getting the, the bonus of, of the attack for it. So it's, like, really screwy. Oh, I'm so jelly of the seven star Koosh, man. So jelly of the seven star Koosh. I want her so bad. She's so good. Oof. She's such a ridiculously strong champ. She just melts stuff, man. With, like, no effort. That wouldn't even be the worst thing, though, Redwood. Like, her dupe is, is actually really nice. I would not be upset with pulling her dupe out of a Titan. Like, it would, obviously, there's new champs in there I'd probably also really want. But, like, if it was her dupe specifically, like, I, I couldn't be mad about that. I took the 6-star to rank 3. I would not mind... I just, I want her as a 7 star so bad, I don't want to invest in the 6 star. I really don't. She'd be so good. Like, specifically because she doesn't need the... The dupe is really nice. Yeah, like, no, she's... Her dupe is solid. Definitely not needed, but, like, it's a nice bonus. Being able to have her things become passive on, on chance uh, and have increased potency for it as well. Like, dude, that's, like, such a good dupe ability. 
that's like a really nice to have but not necessary. Like her dupe is like very well designed. Uh, Oh, I, I had to ban her because she was too good for it. I was just an attacker. Like, I couldn't allow that and me not have one and allow it to stand. Same with Juggernaut. Like, she was just too broken. Because she completely... Not only was she strong, she completely shut down the, the, the meta, basically. She just shut it down. Which is a really bad combo to have your let your opponent have. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it only gets the potency increase if it becomes passive, which is not like guaranteed, but you can make the chance pretty dang high by doing her um her, uh, um, spell thingies. Yeah, she can do bullseyes pretty dang well. I wouldn't say she counters bullseye per se, but, like, she does it really, really well. Yeah. Um, Kush is one of the ones I ban the most. My Sasquatch was still like the, my most banned uh, champion out of my deck. Like, he was banned like legit 95% of the matches. It's, it's crazy to see a champion where like the special one is like their best special. heavy. Brutal. Ugh. Kind of want to take him to rank 2. Probably at some point he'll for sure get ranked up. I knew I was going to get clipped there. I really hate her, like, heavy... Like, she loses out on so much damage if you can't do that, but, like, you can't reliably, like, parry, charge, and like, actually launch it, unless you're... I really don't like Storm X. I really don't. Open another. See, I'm not opening one, though, until it switches over, so even though we're going to get tomorrow the, the final bit, and I'll get a Titan... I'm not going to open it until next week. Because I would be very upset by pulling a dupe on, like, Jabari or something. So. I'm going to wait for it to drop over. crazy how high his block efficiency actually is. What's up, Toof? Did uh, JJ finish? No, she's still gone. Nine K. Bam. Get clapped. Uh, yeah, I can do a friendly, uh, two, just, uh, let me get through the seven stars here. So they're all on cooldown. At, like, the same time. 
and uh, we can do that. And uh, Spider Ham is also going. Uh, have we? I'm not sure. I match a lot of people. So. I'm not sure. <laughs> You're at 70 mil. It's good pace, Tooth. Good pace. Wow, of course. <laughs> you can play when everyone's leaving, yeah. There's some people I generally don't play either. Like, I don't play Andrew because he's always up above me. I play Legacy a, g a good bit, usually. Uh, although I don't think I played him this season. Crap. Um, crap. Um... Play shred uh, usually a few times. There's a, there's a bunch of people I usually end up playing a lot, just because like we place in the kind of same tiers. Max ends up playing me a good bit because we were usually in the same spots for a while and play around the same times too. So I end up matching Max quite a few times. Yeah, Afo, I matched you a few times. Yeah, exactly. Like I, I don't, I don't push Gladiator Circuit until week two. Like I'll still play the first week for like the the objectives and stuff, but um. I kind of like only having two minutes to deal with over over four. I kind of would rather be like three. So like, I would maybe want to play the the first week of GC more because like I don't like generally the first week. Crap. Um. Yeah, ouch. Because uh, it's just like a harder version of the victory track node that's usually kind of sucky. Um, but I do kind of like that the final two weeks is the same meta. Because I like, I like slow down. Whoa. Twenty game medium. Um, like I go slow, and then like the better I do in like a session climbing wise, like I tend to kind of just like like okay, I've climbed enough for today because like I need a I need the points. And if I climb too high too quickly, I'm like I'm gonna wind up losing. I don't know. It's maybe I shouldn't bother so much and just play to until I feel like it. But I don't want to, like, at the same time, climb to a, a particular level and then be like, um, feel like I'm, like, I want to stop for the season, you know, because, like, I want to keep playing because I need the points, so I need to do a certain number of matches still, as well as, like, I want to play for, like, the objectives and stuff. I don't want to, like, get to 450, which would be, like, this season, like, you know, in, in the first two weeks, and then 
you know, be struggling for, for two weeks, you know? So, it just kind of depends on how it's going. Yeah, it's it's rough, AB, because like when I when I drop down that hard, like especially in the last couple of days, where I'm just like, it, it's so rough because you can play for hours and lose progress, you know. JJ, yo, thank you for the raid. Protus, Juan, J Will, what's up, guys? Hopefully the stream holds out for everybody coming in. <laughs> Uh, oh man, what's up, YT? Stop bullying beaches. I don't do that intentionally. What's up, JJ? Welcome. Thanks for the raid, man. Uh, did you, uh, you end up climbing up another bracket, or are you still in Diamond 1 there? I mean, I think if I really just dedicated nothing but the time, and just also got as lucky as I did this season, I don't, and if I did it early enough, because, like, I, I, I think how slow I get up to those kind of points that I am getting to, it's just not realistic to push much higher. Because, like, people are, like, get up to 500 points and then just camp for, like, two weeks, you know? And it's like, I don't want to stop playing for the mode. Like, I want to keep playing the mode because it's fun. Um, so it's like, but I don't think C4, if I, if I went early climb, you know, and like pushed it as high as possible, as quickly as possible, I don't think C4 would necessarily be impossible. It's just not, it'd be very hard and unlikely, but out of the question, I don't think so. Next time I do the tournament... I'm going to have to really, uh, really try for that, uh, position. Because it just, it really realistically wasn't realistic, um, uh, last year to, to push top eight. Go join AQ. I... <laughs> Stone eight. Yeah, you're up. You're up there, though. You're you're doing all right. Uh, the J Fam, what's up, JS? Thank you guys for the uh, dropping in on me. Appreciate it. Pop bottom eight. Like that takes some talent, right there. He's dead. It's like, it is weird for me stopping on Saturday, though, because, like, I really want to play some more, but, like, I don't want to lose my position. And at this point, like, there's so few people playing where I'm at. Like, it's it's way too risky for me to try and, 
and match because if I if I do match someone, it's gonna be someone so far below me, uh, likely that I'll, I'll lose like twenty points if I lose, and that's just you know I already hitting where I did. I matched so far below me a couple times that I only won ten points off of them, like two two different people ten points twice. So in two matches, I won twenty points, which is terrible. I'd love to play either one of them. Um, I'd love to match Andrew and 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 see what it uh, see what I could do versus him. It's like he definitely has the bigger deck. Like my deck's not bad, which is why I can you know do as well as I do. Like, um, you know, it's it's. A lot of strategy, a little bit of luck, you know, on, on the drafts and stuff. And just, you know, playing well, which, you know, doesn't always happen. Also, the opponent sometimes not playing well. It just, you know, something, stuff happens. Yeah, I do match Dooley a lot, too. I don't I don't think I matched him at all this though, season either, though. I usually match them a ton. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't watch the the Andrew versus Barrow stream. But yeah, he just he's got a lot of champions that, like, in the right scenarios, will just destroy what you put down. You know. All right, throw it. Thank you. And you're dead. Matching again in zero. I matched him a few times too. Bald summer showdown. as I am. Nice. So all seven stars are max rank one at least. I don't have any unleveled seven stars. Which is cool. It's so cool seeing the, the stars on the Deathless Guillotine. So nice. I'm hoping it doesn't take as long to get the dupe on King Groot as it did uh, Guillotine. Can you throw a special... Eh, he's dead. I kind of want to rank this dude, man. He's, like, so factually fun to use. Uh, the next Deathless, I'm not sure. We have King Groot. And then two more, and then Thanos. I'm not sure if we know. I think there's, like, suspicions based on, like, the... We'll see. 
But to, oh, and there's the there's the game crash. Yeah, yeah, Skabar with the. It didn't completely crash, it just kind of got a kink in its neck. It quickly snapped out. So we fine. Uh, what is going on here? Yeah, it's I I yeah, it happens all the time. All the dang time. Okay, you didn't get through it, you jerk face. You were still intimidated. So, uh, let's see, uh, if the 123 mine setups is supposed to include battlegrounds. Uh, battlegrounds is separate, yeah, it's a separate thing. So you still have to save your, your, uh, your battlegrounds uh, set up separately. So you can set set up one of the the loadouts and then save it to the uh, like the BG deck and then change it, kind of like just how it was before. But now you can have different setups. However, the setups are bugged right now, or at least with recoils they are. Um, like if you swap out and then swap back to it, like it's it's it bugs it out. So apparently restarting the game fixes it, from what I've heard, but I have not confirmed that myself. So Technab, but we should still have at least one more. Round right, yeah. This should be the last one. Yeah, the the PI, uh, but it also like if you're running recoil, not only is it just the PI, not it's you're actually not actually getting the attack bonus either. Like the attack isn't in getting increased. So, the mastery straight up just aren't working properly if if uh, uh, while it's bugged out. Yeah. What's up, Chief? Oh, man. Get out of my face. Yeah, the, the, the attack thing being messed up, I just confirmed earlier. Which is a big bummer. So, Kabam needs to get that sorted, like, ASAP. Whew. Let's see, I do have two more seven stars. So the question is, do I run a, a team with two seven stars in it, or do I just call it good here? And I feel like I should just... Go ahead and do it. And yeah, let's run hood for it. Perfect. 
<laughs> 96 k points. Yeah, that's, um, I'm just that good. Like, when you first set up a, a, a setup, like, it, it for sure works just fine. Grab the unblockable. Grab. Okay. I got a little lucky there. Um, uh, just, just units, basically. You're double sparky. Ah, you're taking the double sparky, yeah. Nice. How was it for you? I, I actually rather enjoyed it. It was not bad at all. I need to I need to run the 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 six stars attached to but um, or and, and the four stars but um, let's see with a two is it were you the one that wanted the the friendly I'll do that do that first got better though yeah that's, I mean that's the That's part of the plan, or the goal of it, you know, to get better. Zemo, the Zemo one, I had a couple rough spots, but overall it wasn't, um, wasn't bad at all. In my deck. <laughs> well, you don't uh, you don't like my deck. I like my deck. I got a, I got a good deck. I got a good one. Yeah, I don't have any I don't have any rank fours in the deck. do a couple get the BG fix in yeah sure why not you have a rank one domino in the deck dang yeah I don't have any rank one seven stars in the deck I don't have any rank four uh, six stars it's all all rank fives ascended rank twos and uh, and all that good stuff. So it's a good it's a good time. As long as we don't screw this up, we should be okay. Come on. I need you to throw it. Dang it. 
Well, I lost. <laughs> I'm not going to get the crits. We didn't die! <laughs> Point zero 0.03. I got 40 points for health. Oh, man. Uh. Uh. Whew. Oh, my gosh. That was too funny. do the fight. I personally don't like Kate for it, though. Right, I need to try this. Uh, I suck at this matchup. Um, I kind of want to push him special to... Ah. Yeah, I just, I suck at this matchup, man. Alberto. And you were boat bragging about, like, oh, man, you were clapping people now. Get on my level, son. <laughs> Maroon. That seemed... I know that sounds familiar. Who is this? That's Gabar. Okay, I knew I knew that it was familiar. Uh, let's see. I'm pretty sure I got you, Afo, in here. I thought I did. Do I not have you, Afo? I do not. Apparently, okay. All right, we are out of room, so. Uh, who the heck is this?
there is no name. So we're just going to go ahead and uh, get rid of that one. I don't know. Might have been somebody like I friended to like after a BG match or something, and then forgot to. Uh... For shame! We're alive. We're alive. Stream's still here. It, we're intact. It's a miracle. We survived, albeit barely. Uh, who did I fight? Uh, apart from. If I had tigered it, like, which I could have done, it would have been, like, fine. Verizon Wi-Fi. I mean, there is that. Alright, let's see if I can get this. Something to work out for me would be great. Let's do it. Let's do it. Nicholas Fuji. How do I want to deal with him, though? That's really the question. Let's see if I can't tiger this sucker. Distinctly possible, but also also distinctly could mess it up. Like, let me get an in, please. That would be great. That was not super great, but <laughs> we got it. <laughs> Spider Gwen, yay! Ah. Considering I didn't have like one of my more wanted options for a Nick Fury, I'll take it. He had stand your ground, it just it only triggered like the ones. GG's Chavez is just kinda extra slow for that matchup. Like in general. 
and like it actually gets slowed down quite a bit because of having to wait out the the stuff even though it gives her power just not being able to be as aggressive kind of hurts kind of hurts Come on. Ah, that was, that was not great. That should still be sufficient. <laughs> they don't just give Celestial 5, 10, just anybody to. I mean, come on. We are pretty good at the game. <laughs> Give you some credit. Uh, we weren't trying that hard, too. You would have had me round three if I had, if you had, if, uh, because I messed up round two so bad. But if I if I had just played straight up for for the win and used Tiger on that fight, like it would have been fine. But because Tiger Tiger would have clapped uh, onslaught way better than I did with Shocker, <laughs> uh, assuming he played ball at least. Serpent's just a freaking dick. It really doesn't matter who you fight him with. He's just. I don't like fighting him. Oh yeah, and the bullseye matchup, I messed up pretty badly too. But that one, if it had gone the way it was supposed to, even if your kite fight, fight went perfectly, you stood no, no chance. But because I messed it up so hard, you actually did have a chance round one. <laughs> Alright, GG Zappo. Uh. All right, we got arena. Yeah, the I I got a little bit lucky fighting yours. It's a little bit on the sketch side. This <laughs> casually four zero. I'm back to the arena. You're darn right. Arena time. One point, yeah, that'd be why. It's only what, like, is it a twenty? Is it a full twenty percent chance at, at level one? It's not that high. Fifty percent is like miserable when it's maxed, but gamma two. How many? How many trophies is that? Because I think, I think C five is like eighty k, right? Because then it's like 90 for C4, 100 C3, 110 C2, and then I think 130. So I think that's right. I think I, I think it's 80K for, for C5. Because I'm pretty sure Mysterium 1 is only like 60. That sounds about right. Only 20K tokens. Bro! So this is why like I need a place higher. Because like, I need the trophy tokens to get... The roster keeping on point, you know, so I can get 80 tokens the next season, you know, which doesn't always happen. Like it's, I haven't always finished Celestial, but more often than not, I do. So 
Some some seasons are extra rough for me. I wasn't completely shafted by the uh, the metas though, which is good. Ooh, I was not ready for the double medium there. Twenty k though, jeez, bro. I feel like that's probably why so many people complain, though. Like, the average person, you know, that places, you know, gamma or lower, like, complains so much about BG rewards, like, sucking. Because, like, a lot of the rewards of Battlegrounds is, like, the store. And you can't buy that much from the store if you uh, aren't getting the tokens from, you know, playing it. Um, the T the T six I get a lot actually from the daily crystals for from being valiant. Uh, makes up actually a pretty large chunk. Um, I've only bought since the valiant store reset. I've only bought like I don't know maybe five or six tier six basic tier three alpha from the store. Like I haven't been maxing that out like at all because I just I I was have I had such an excess like I just I didn't need them. Um, I've been holding on to them for several weeks um so i get a little bit from a uh, glory store um and they just have been kind of piling up on me not even all my rank fives are in the deck i'm i'm missing several like i wasn't i wasn't running um uh I wasn't running um, Valkyrie. Ooh. And I still have an Ascension that I, I haven't done either. Next month I'll have I'll have, I'll be able to do two. So I'm I'm undecided who I want to ascend right now. But I'll af, af, after I, a little bit next month, I'll be able to do two. So, I... I don't know. But, you know, you just do a little bit of... You just do all the things that are available, and they... You know, that adds up. The rank up mats add up, son. Especially with the, because I have been maxing out the the T six from the the battleground store every week, which is a lot of catalyst. And I think I think Tooth, don't you have more rank twos than I do though, or is am I am I thinking of DTX? How many how many rank twos do you have, Tooth? I got a little lucky on the tiger fight, slightly. <laughs> I got slightly lucky. I also played it smart, though, and was, like, purposefully doing my combo to push him at t to 20. So, like, he wouldn't be unblockable anymore. So it wasn't, like, entirely random, but... Yeah. He only resisted, like, the once... I got lucky he didn't punish me after I tried to heavy through his special two though. That was that was straight luck, because he would have just straight clapped me. Would have straight clapped me. You did. It was it twice. Yeah. You know. Either way, the majority didn't get resisted. Thank you. Oh, we're not getting the uh, the vulnerabilities because he's of course he's freaking. What the heck? Why did that not shrug off like almost immediately? Jerk face. Come on.
can truly tell. And broken. Ugh. Either ways, I, I lost so much health, though, in the stupid, um... In that, um... Uh, in that Onslaught versus CGR matchup? Or CGR versus Onslaught, rather. Oh my gosh. It depends. It depends on, like, how much you value what's currently... Because I, I opened up a 7-star just, like, yesterday. Um, because, like, I wanted what's in the basic more than I want, like, what's moving to it. And, like, increasing the pool size. So... Uh, or CJ or 7-star. I would say it depends on the 7-star Cosmic. Um... CGR is great. I, I would maybe potentially hold off to see what the next season's meta is. If CGR is still going to work, I would say probably CGR. It's the last six on the list of on the Titan uh, crystal screen. So it's it's uh, Photon... Um, or no, Photon's already... Hold on, no. It's, it's Spider-Ham, Jabari... Um... Who all is it? It's Jabari, Spider Ham, um, Dubon Sean, yeah. The because it's, it's a base, like Sig One is ten percent more damage on his crits, like just at base ten percent damage extra on crits, like that's solid. And most of his hits, like, the majority of his hits, the way he's played, are crits. Um, so it, it's actually a very nice dupe. By no means necessary, but, like, it is a solid damage bump. For sure. Um, is it a physical burst, though, or is it, um... I forget. Come on. Like, give me an in, please. That would be great. Yeah. Yeah, it's physical burst. Yeah, so physical resistance would lower it a little bit. Physical vulnerability, increase it, obviously. There we go. We got the extended that time. Get wrecked, son. Yeah, I knew that was going to reach. Uh, yeah, Shang-Chi, honestly, he doesn't feel like he scales as well as a 7-star as, like, it felt like he probably should. I feel like I used him, like, really, really well in a lot of, like, matchups back when I was using the rank 3 6-star, but, like, now, like, you get up to that special 2, and it just feels like it doesn't even half kill your opponent, even if you're using, like, a rank 2 Shang, which just, like, ugh, it's wild.
So, I don't know. Like, I kind of wanted to pull him, but, like, at the same time, now after seeing a, enough of his gameplay, like, it just feels like he wouldn't be good enough. Especially in the skill class, when there's some, like, really solid, fast champions, he just doesn't seem to cut it. Uh, as good as he is, like, he's a solid, he's got good utility with the slow, and the way you can do his combos and stuff, but... It just doesn't seem to be quite it. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Because he countered the meta perfectly, too. Um, I didn't see him in a lot of people's decks. Like, not a lot of people have, like, the 7-star or anything, but... I just... I didn't see a lot of them. It's a bit of a shame, because I do like Shang. I had a lot of fun using him for the Karina's, uh... Um... Challengers, Karina's challenge for an abyss. Like that was that was a good time. There's a lot, there's a lot, of, especially since a lot of people like were trying to use them, like how a lot of people would just like nuke and were like pushing, pushing red, you know, uh, and just like going ham, and like that's just not a great idea with them. People would try them for, like, Mystics, and then, then the Precisions would fall off, and then, you know, MD would be a problem. Like, it just, like, he just couldn't do the matches you wanted him to do, which is a shame. Because, like, it was, it, it's kind of it would be one of his better metas. Like, if he was going to work for a meta, you'd think, you know, one where he prevents the node from being problematic would be his better uh, kind of scenario, but it just... Sadly not. He is really cool, and he, I think he's well-designed. Like, he's really strong. Uh, I like him as he is. I don't think he, like, needs a buff or anything. He just... Um, but something definitely just feels a little bit slightly off. Trying to parry that. Let me parry. Thank you. Okay, now you're dead. Sheesh. Yeah, that is also true. Uh, which is also what made Serpent extra annoying to fight with literally anybody else that can't couldn't like keep control of the stuff um just because you couldn't parry him shoot um made him he's gonna be he's still gonna be annoying to fight i think in the next season but being able to parry him is gonna make a huge huge difference um, so we'll we'll see how annoying he still winds up being. Come on. Yeah, what am I doing? Just throw. Yeah. Chavez, Tiger, I did it once really, really well with Titania, which Titania was a harder matchup because of all the extra buffs, not being able to parry. I think she'll work for it a lot better in a, in a season where you can parry. Your, your setup? Uh, like your deck? I thought the deck was fine, right? Who did I ban? <laughs> I'll be honest, I just kind of, uh, mindlessly go through BG sometimes, and it's just, like, on autopilot. The defensive masteries, um, I don't know. What, what were you using defensively? It's not like I can tell. Uh, I wasn't, in the matchup I did versus you, like, stand your ground wasn't, like, a, a thing that mattered for the matchups I did. 
with the champs I was using. So like that was wasn't a role at all. Um, so I I'm not sure exactly what exactly you were running. But I don't think I don't think they matter. Um, let me saying a tune phase again. Unfazed could come into play versus uh, for a couple off uh, offensive champions. Um, Elsa being one of them, um, which was still solid this meta for like photons and stuff. Could definitely uh, screw some people up. And all it takes is like it triggering once, and then then your match is ruined. Um. Ooh, oh, good. I'm like, I'm like, I thought I got clipped up, cause we did. Um. Yeah, limber, limber, solid. You have uh, MD, and that's a proficiency, but I mean, so is limber, but. Oh, Max, Max Energy, two out of five. Yeah, no, I think I read that right. Good enough. Uh, no MD, okay. Um, I personally really value MD. It makes any Mystic on defense, like, way more annoying. Um. I mean, for AWD, if you don't have any Mystics on your AW defense, it doesn't matter. But, like, for BGs, if you, if you have any Mystics you ever place on defense, like, it's, it's a solid W. And it certainly helps, uh, like, your Mystics offensively as well, getting the power from it. Even, like, offensively, it's it's really helpful for a lot of offensive uh, use as well. I run it at 5 out of 5 for, for BGs. On the occasion, like, it can mess you up and, like, give you more power than you'd like, but a lot of the times it, like, helps speed you up significantly as well. It is just something extra you have to kind of manage and know that you're, like, okay, if they've got a lot of buffs, if one of them expires or you nullify it, it's going to bump your power up and you kind of have to play around it, but... If you're keeping an eye on it and paying attention to it, like it does speed you up. It certainly helped a lot for Mojo, because he gains power so slow. <laughs> Without the extra from buffs and stuff. Yeah, but it's less threatening like off uh, like defensively, only at only three out of five. That's why I like the extra um the extra bit. I mean, it's what five percent uh, power on a buff expire. I mean, it, it more than doubles the 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 other two points more than double the the amount of power that they gained. And twelve percent is just over a third of a bar of power. Oh, dude, Mojo was so much fun. He was still really, even though like. With all the like the extra buffs and stuff, he still felt slow, like offensively slow. I think maybe part of that was like because you couldn't parry a lot of the time or something. I don't know. Because like even when I had a good run of like a serpent with with my mojo, like it was still like more than a sixty second fight. Like he just didn't have quick fights.
Gladiator, I really like the Gladiator buff. Um, if he's going to work out well next season, I am highly considering ranking him up. Yeah. Yeah, if you get their good prompt RNG, like... The problem is, like, you have to, like, actually slow yourself down to actually have, like, a particular speed. And I'm not sure, like, what the kind of middle ground is. Because you want to ramp up to, to five prompts, or, like, you know, five charges or whatever, to max amount and get the Fury... But to get to that point faster, you have to, like, dance around so that, because, like, the timers are paused during both of the champion's special attacks. So, like, you don't want to be giving them specials to throw, and you want to, like, as soon as you're given a new prompt, you want to complete it immediately so it, it, it starts the timer on it expiring so you can get a new prompt and get another charge. So it, it's kind of a hard dance around. And you have to, you know, control your power, and especially with MD. Yeah, the dash back and hold block, or dash back one easy, like dodge a hit easy. Like holding block can be annoying. Yeah, we'll do it this way. Um, Uh, I will, but I'm going to hold off until we see exactly how we get a rank 3 from 8.4. Because uh, um, if we get a gem, I need to figure out what class I get, if it's like a class-based gem, before I throw Catalyst into a rank 3. Um, if we're given, like, Catalyst... So I need, to, I need to see, like, what gives us the rank 3 before I make the decision on who to do. Yeah, so you remove the... Like, exactly. That was also useful for, like, to get the uh, extra power and stuff. Um, but again, it's still... Uh, but yeah, like, even any... Of, none of my fights, I don't think, with Mojo were, like, less than 60 seconds. Um, I have three in mind right now, and I can only do two at w with... Wow, an 8.4, and that's assuming I can do any two I want, depending on how we're, like, if we're given a generic, I can do whoever. If we're given a class gem and it's random, though, like, it, it would, you know, I might not be able to do who I want to do, so that's kind of the unfortunate side. In which case, I would have to potentially maybe do an unawakened champion. Um... Which I don't want to do because I want to, I don't want it to like suck for prestige. Um, I'm not like aiming for prestige specifically, but I don't want it to suck either. Um, so right now the three most wanted are Chavez. That's a must. Like I'm using the cats on her. Um, like for sure. Um, like if if I if if what we get for eight point four is like a random gem, she's getting the rank three. Like I don't I don't care. She is hundred percent getting it. Um. Other options are Mantis and Shuri. Are like the three most wanted, I think, right now. Yeah, if I got if there was like a cosmic gem, I think I'd have to go Maestro, even though he is unawakened. Uh, just because like the difference like if you have a counter. Well, like, even if you have a counter, like, just the difference, like, the longer his fight goes, the more annoying he is. So, like, the bigger your maestro is, like, it's just better. Shuri is very versatile and, you know, can just be a really painful fight on D as well. Um... With, you know, all her mechanics, the block damage, because you can't parry her with most champions. Um, the uh, untouchable, so you can't hit her. Um, you know, it's just, she's, and offensively, she's very, very versatile. And not, 
like the fastest, but like she can get basically anybody down. Six star rank four Necro, oof, painful. I kind of like Vox too, but like I don't think I could do a Vox. I really don't. Because I have Vox, like I, I never ranked two them. I almost did. I kind of considered rank twoing a, a Vox, but I never ended up doing it. Yeah, I would still really like to rank three Maestro at some point, and he will at some point. Hundred percent. Hundo Presendo for Shuro. Machuro. Um, it's just a matter of like when we'll get the cats needed for it. Red Skull. Dude, that would be it. I would for sure rank two of them if I pulled him. Um, just because he's domino counter, he's good offensively, he's a butt on defensively for a lot of scenarios. Yeah, rank one. Rank one's a little bit too small. Like, he dies with versus a lot of champions. Uh, rank two is like a, a middle ground. Rank three is just extra butt. Yeah. He got shot down by a lot of options. But, like, for sure, like, a rank 2 Chavez can just one special 2 one-shot a, a rank 1 Maestro. Like, it'll just... It'll just down him that fast. A rank 2... You'd have to get really good crit RNG to pull that off. And a rank 3 is just not happening. Unless you have a rank 3 Chavez. Which, when I do, she'll either get banned and... You know... Hulk, Hulk is another solid one. I still don't have him. I really hope there's a a, a basic selector, like a, a base pool champ selector uh, for Act Eight, because I would I will 100% take Hulk. I gotta get Hulk up. Gotta do it. Ugh. I, I kind of imagine it, it. We're kind of likely to get, and it's rather unfortunate because that means we can't like necessarily do who we want. If we were to just get the catalyst, we could do whoever. Um. Getting the all the catalysts we need would essentially be like getting a generic, and I don't see them giving us a generic um, for Act Eight. Like it just doesn't really make sense to. So I imagine what we're gonna get is like a random class and maybe some extra like tier four alpha on top, but not like enough for a full rank up. Um, I'm wondering if there will be like be enough like one and a half extra, maybe so like another half one towards. And, like, if the offer at the end of Act 8 also gives one and a half, if that'll give, like, an, an extra rank three or not, that would be kind of cool. Um, but we'll try and have to wait and see. Yeah. At the very least, I'd like it to be, like, a class Nexus gem. So it's not, like, just one in six. It's more, like significantly better odds, like, more like 50-50 odds you get the, the, the kind of class you want. Like, I, I would have a rank 3 in every class at some point. But there's some champs that, like, I would want, like, their dupe before I do. Because, like, I, as much as I like Domino, I rank 2 to run dupe. I don't know if I want to rank 3 or Unawakened. Um, Bishop, I would rank 3 Unawakened. But until I have, like, a full set of, like, 
prestige rank threes with like their awakened abilities. I don't think I'd want to do. I don't particularly want to do anyone um, unawakened. And I definitely don't have an awakened champion of each class that I want to rank three. Yeah. And that's the one thing, like, as well, because, like, I already have the rank three Mystic. But Chavez is just too good to not rank three. She's She's been so solid in every meta. Offensively or defensively or both. Um, and she's just super fun and easy to use, too. I was actually really happy to get her duped, because it actually affected her more than I was thinking it would. Definitely doesn't need it, but boy, howdy, is it nice. Oh, for sure, she's a top 10 champion. Like she is super nasty. Ooh. Knew that was going to happen. Okay. Yeah, tech. Because I have Shocker. Well, I have Shuri too, so never mind. Tech, tech is fine. I would, I would rank three. Shuri. Yeah, Shocker can also do Maestros. Not like the best, but like he can do it just fine. Dude, a rank 3 Awakened 7 stars, dude, that would be 100% banned every time. He'd be so, like, dude, just ramp up to like 5 charges. And he could frickin' kill anybody at rank 3. Um, like, that would be absurd. That's filthy. Yeah, my Venom... Like, I would like to take to rank 3, too, just because of that, like... Just insane the quick he's got. The man has the quickness. Ridiculous. I have, I have no regrets uh, of Sassy being, like, my first one, though. Because he, he was so, so good. Like, he's fun to use offensively, especially when it crits on that special two. Just kills everything. And defensively, he's such a tank. I wish he wasn't banned as much as he was, though, because, like, I have the champions I need to not worry about him if my opponent gets him. Um... And, uh, oh my gosh, I knew that was going to happen. I slowed that down. Like, come on, just, just die. Thank you. All right. Um, like occasionally you'll be stuck without a counter, but, like, rank three is so big. Without, like, a Titania or a pig, like, specifically, like, uh, I mean, I guess Scorpion too. But, like, not, not this last meta. Like Scorpion's still not, like, my favorite way to do that matchup. Titania, Titania and Pig are, are the best. Pig is the most fun. Titania just, you know, nukes it down real fast. Yeah, the Cosmic class was not amazing. But, I mean, we have Hype. Hype would be a nasty rank 3. Uh, 
Alpha Beta Stigma, I have no idea who that is. I'll leave it for now, if, if, if that person's in the chat, we'll, we'll get it sorted, but... Otherwise we are declining ads, I have no idea who it is. Gladiator! How did I know? Kitty also is a really good for bullseye, if you didn't know. I really like this dude. I'm kind of surprised he didn't end up in the in the seven star pool. Although I think he kind of relies a little bit more on his sig than like Luke Cage does, but. Shield today, yeah, dude. I've opened so many features and can't get myself a bullseye. It's very frustrating. It's quite annoying. He's the only one I'm missing. Yeah, I kind of wanted to rank up Shield, but yeah, it, it's hard to like put so much like certain. Even good six stars, like it's hard to want to invest a highly in them. Um, like the new ones, because it's like, unless they're like super busted, offensively or defensively, and like the six star will just you know kind of suffice. Like I really want their seven star variant, you know, because I don't want to rank up the six star and then get the seven star. You know, unless this, like, you need the six star SIG or whatever. Like, I did that with Photon, because, like, I was like, not getting a Photon anytime soon, and the six star is just going to do me better. Uh, with, with, you know, Max SIG ascended and whatnot. So, like, that, that was, like, an exception I made because of how she functioned. So now, like, even if I got a seven star Photon, it wouldn't be better until I could get her to rank three, and that's just. Those are too rare, so like the six star will be fine for like way, way a while. Yeah. That's more of the rank than anything. Like it'll still work, but yeah, I get that. Yeah, Silk is such a ridiculous nuke that she gets banned a lot too. Um, especially like if she's like rank three. Goodbye. She nukes way too many. And that's the scary thing about Mantis. Like big rank three Mantises can nuke basically any uh, any champion at rank two, even with class disadvantage. Like I've had rank three Mantises just one shot kill my uh, bishop on defense. I'm like, what's the point of the? She can also nuke uh, onslaughts. Like she's just kind of ridiculous. I want to silk so bad because she she's so fun to use, 
And the way she works, like, she gains so much reach with the increased rank attack. Oh my gosh, let's see if we can get you to... Come on. I don't think I've tried this since. There we go. That time we got it. Only took a bajillion tries. It's not as easy, like, it still technically works, but it's not like it used to be. It used to be just, like, super easy to do, and now it's, like, ever since last update. Um, oh, that reminds me. They didn't fix Photon, did they? Uh, on defense? figure out um yeah and like he'll switch if like he hits you with a fourth light but like it's almost impossible to get him to do that like he's very like medium ending heavy like he'll just like medium medium into your block or medium light medium like he doesn't want to like light you at all he either finish with a medium or um you know just go straight go for a heavy which are both annoying I was trying to get it in. Didn't get it. Thanks for punching me in the face. I appreciate it. Nightcrawler is just a bit of annoying. Like, I almost want to rank up, like... See, I... See, Nightcrawler is a weird one, because, like... I knew... With Photon, like, I probably wouldn't be getting the 7-star anyway. And the benefit she gets from the SIG make, would make the 6-star worth it, regardless. But there's something about knowing, like, I am going to be getting the 7-star Nightcrawler. Like, that's going to happen. It's not like, like, we know basically when, right when we're going to get it. But the 7-star without the dupe is worthless offensively compared to the 6-star. But, like, defensively, still kind of annoying. So it's like, ah, do I, do I rank him up? I don't know. Don't know. Probably won't. Probably just have a bit of fun with the seven star. We'll see though. I kind of hope we get some more like six star rank up gems too. Uh, in, in Act 8 exploration stuff. That would be really nice. I don't think there's any harm in that, because, like, the, the, the rank 5s aren't needed for, like, um, like, it's a good way of them buff, like, increasing, like, the value of Act 8 rewards without, like, do being weird on the power scaling and just giving the cats that people could use on 7 stars. Um, when you when the six stars don't count for the title at that point, so I 
feel like they could add like a, a couple. It would be really nice. Probably won't, but if they have to settle, I'd like at least two. But I'll like they'll probably maybe give us one. I'd hope at least. It'd be nice. They've got to give us at least one rank five gem for the the full act uh, story. I don't I don't see them not doing that. Like, just Act Completion will probably have some decent, cool stuff in it. And then Act Exploration. Um, we'll have to see. Another game crash. We'll see what's up. Uh, I kind of want a piece of jerky. Piece of jerky. Jerky. Yum. Dude, this home screen looks so cool. Yeah, it'll probably be a one to two gem in there too. Yeah, it probably won't lose that. Probably you won't have. I don't know. I still want to see those because I want to rank up six stars still, but I don't want to put the catalyst in them. It's feeding time. Yeah, we want we wanted a snack. And it's delicious. What? Season 3? I've never even heard of it. Dude, we had, I had so many shows drop yesterday. There was like three different isekais, and I was like, oh, bro. I was super happy about it. I'm digging them. New season of shows dropping. I was happy with it. I like me my isekais. Some people think they're overused. I they're used a lot. I can't get enough of them though. So they my favorites. Because for me, they're almost like a subcategory of like what I really like, and that's you know like the fantasy kind of shows, and they're just like a an extra subcategory of those. Um, we got a lot. I need to, I still need to update my list with, um, um, my tracker too. I'm like way behind on that. I gotta finish off a couple too. That I kind of fell off on. Uh, Gen V, yeah, I've, uh, I'm aware of that one. The, um, or Gen V, are you talking about the, the bad boys, like, kind of side story, or, like, is it, like, a something anime, because I'm pretty sure there's, like, a Gen V animated something, too, I think. Maybe it's Gen Z, or am I thinking of? Quite possible. Yeah, the, the the boys side story. Okay. Yeah. But I also heard, uh, and it was, you know, we were talking about it on Max's last night, too, about the, the actor from um, from there just died this last weekend in an accident. Oh, now it's showing the, the X-Magica little symbol on the, the thingies. 
Dude, where was that all freaking season that was supposed to be there and it just wasn't? Now now that we're the the thing is over. Like the boost is oh, what the Saga Champion boost. Whatever. It's part of the filming crew. Wow. Dang. That's pretty cool, though. Yeah, my... Oldest brother does uh, movies and shows and stuff. He's a stuntman. So he's... Works with a lot of actors and stuff. Yeah, okay, we got the hit off. It's a different world, the the film industry. Yeah, yeah, that makes it tricky, though. I mean, obviously, there's, there's no way around it, because, I mean, you know, it's, you know, it's, it's um, what I'd like, what I think, not like, I'd like, but what I think what would be good to see, and obviously this would require different permissions, probably from, like, the family and stuff, is, you know, to, like, use CG to kind of, like, have, like, um, have him like do his part in a little bit, kind of like how whatever the 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 guy's name from um, one of the the Fast and Furious movies, how he like died during filming, and they you know like had his brother or whatever, uh, and then like mapped his face onto him so he could like fill that role or whatever, and kind of like have him you know, get him out of the show that way, and have you know like a in memory of you know his name or whatever for the for the episodes or whatever um, until they can do something else. Would be good to see, I would think, personally. Um, yeah, Paul Paul Walker, Cody Walker, yeah, yeah. Um, the the store, the, the currency is, is, is sticking around zero, so, like, the store is gonna reset and got some new items that you can purchase, so, like, there's nothing wrong with having extra currency, because, like, it'll just, it'll just, um, I'm losing the word I want to use, um, roll over to the next event and you can just keep using it. Something something to that effect though, Penguin, is what I would think would be like interesting to see. But they'd still have to like do some rewriting to the you know, if they didn't plan on like you know, him dying off in the show or something, having him you know, either die in the show or um you know, for whatever other reason you know, have it, have his peace yeah, and be gone uh, for future since he's no longer around. Um, but it, it, you know, it, there's any number of ways they could do it, um, and I think they're usually pretty good about that sort of thing in, in that industry. When you know, especially you know, in a tragic case like this, um, that they you know they usually do pretty good justice by the by the actors when it comes to that. Yeah. Best isekai I've watched? Ooh. I don't know if I could... It would be my favorite, but, like, it, it is... Like, its season is just uh, coming... A new season is uh, just starting to come out right now. It is uh, Reincarnated as a Slime is very, very good. One of my favorites, by far. Um, 
Absolute favorite? I don't know. I'd have to go through like, a list of ones I've watched. That's definitely up there, though, for sure. Um, it's, it's third season is is uh, is coming out um, this uh, season, though, which is pretty sweet. And I think um, My Hero Academia, not an isekai, but My Hero Academia's seventh season is um, starting up uh, this season, too, I think, in a couple weeks. Which I'm also very excited about. Oh, yeah, if you haven't checked, it's so good. It's, it's, like, even, even my other friend, like, when I told him, like, it's a weird-sounding name, um, but, like, he got into it, he also really liked it. I was like, you're darn right you like it. It's that good. Weird names aside, because, like, we can't really go out, like, sometimes they name stuff oddly, you know, it's just kind of, because they reuse, like, the manga names, and, you know, those are often long and, like, very pointed, you know, kind of oddly. I've watched, I've watched some that are just, like, bizarrely named, and it's like, no, they're still really good. Like, just kind of ignore the name, you know, it's just watch the show. Overlord, Overlord's fantastic. Oh. Another isekai-ish sort of one. I'd, I'd put it in that category. Um, also very, very good. Uh, I'm still waiting on the next season of that, which also I think is coming out soonish. Um, this year, I think, at least. I don't think this season, but at least this year or something like that. Uh, Overlord's fantastic. I've watched a lot. <laughs> uh, I've I've gone through hundreds of shows. It is already out, really? I haven't I haven't come across it yet. Or no. No, it did. I'll have to look through. Um I'm caught up with it from what, like, it, it's, I think it had, no, it had four seasons. I'm, wait, I'm waiting for, like, the next season, though, is what I'm waiting on. I'll have to double check it. Yeah, those Overlord's great. Uh, not really, no. Um, MCOC just kind of eats up all my time. <laughs> um, uh, not like I hate on other games, it's just like I, I put so much time into this one, I don't have time for a lot of else. Um, you know, better, better or worse. I mean, so I'm not like against playing other games. Like, I have a PlayStation and uh, and stuff, um, but I don't, I don't really play PC games, though. Yeah. <laughs> I do, I do a lot of Arena. Georgie, yo, what's up? How's it going, man? I haven't played any like new newer game though in ugh, I don't even know how many years. There's a lot of games I would like to to play that I just you know either don't have the system for. Um, like there's some like Zelda games that I would like to play but just never have. Um, one of my favorite series is. Um, uh, that has a game for the PS5 that, you know, I don't have the system or the game, so can't play it, but I would love to play. Um, the Ratchet & Clank series is one of my favorite game series. 
Um, wow, finish the day you, you released. That's like that's impressive uh, for for a brand new game. Like it'd be a hard time. You'd be hard pressed a lot of the time finishing a game in a day, even if you knew knew the game. Like that's very very short. What's up, DTX? Oh. Um, but I've like I've only ever bought like one Steam game. Um, that was like, because it was like, that was its only release for the, for the game. That's like part of a, of a, a series that I really like of like old, uh, uh, like flash games. But you know, when flash died, um, you know, find it in 31 hours. That's short. Yeah. Jeez. That's wild. But, uh, but MCOC is great. I love MCOC. And I like, you know, being at the level I play at, so. Yeah, spring cleaning might make things kind of go south a little bit. We'll see. I'm hoping they don't go too crazy on it. Like, I don't mind it existing, so long as it's not, like, just absurd. Because it was pretty big last last year. And realistically, the big problem with it is it's basically only spending. Like, if it had, like, unit deals, you could pick up, like, if you had the units as well to kind of, like, you know, kind of, like, July 4th and Cyber do. And make it less bad for the free-to-play. That would be one thing, but, like, it's strictly, like cash or nothing because you get a little bit for free because there's like arena you can get some of the doubloons or whatever through but um yeah but I'm, I'm hoping since they are saying like like they're trying to wind back some of the bigger offer days to not just be crazy because they, they they went way too far last july 4th like it was so stupid the game took a while to recover from july 4th The Souls games. I, I like RPGs. Um, 200 hours on Elden Ring. I'm a big fan of, like, games where, like, you can upgrade and level up stuff. Um, like, there's just something satisfying. Like, even just, like, random flat. Like, if there's something for me to, like get experience in and level up and upgrade like i just i love the crap out of that it's just very satisfying to me um i can't i can't get enough of it like it always throws things out of whack a little bit but like july 4th like it was way out of whack um let's see um this is starting to lose yeah No, I, I, my interest is still fine in, in MCOC. Um, I've actually not even seen any, like, Elden Ring gameplay or anything, so I, I have no idea, like, how the game functions. But I, I do have points, like, right now, like, there's nothing for me to do in-game apart from, like, Arena, because, like, BG's is done, it's about to be an off-season. Um, 
there's no content for me to do. Um, oh crap, that's one hit too many. Ouch. Um, so like, I, I don't mind any like suggestions of something maybe to do when I do hit those points where it's like, well, I'm bored of what I could pot what there's what's available to me in, in, in MCOC right now and do something else. It's exactly like solo leveling. What, what is Elden Ring? I, I might could probably get into that if it is. He's <laughs> solo leveling so good. Um, it's so good. Oh, yep, now the boost is back. Frickin'. You pump into stats, you take on bigger bosses and dungeons. That does sound like my kind of, uh, my kind of thing, to be honest. But I'm also cheap and, you know, don't want to buy a game. <laughs> Uh, not that I could really, really should anyway, because, you know. I'm, uh, not really in a, in a position for that. Ooh. I already shouldn't play MCOC like I do, but... I do anyway. Secret millionaire eyes. I wish. No, nah, not really. Um, I mean, yes, but no. Like, because, you know, then I wouldn't have to worry about money. But, uh, no, nah, I'm not like... Like, I, I live well below my general means, because, like, I just, I do, that's just, like, it just, so, like, money has never been, like, up there, you know, like, I just, not motivated by it like that, so, there's some people that's, like, just workaholics, like, and just work, 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 money, you know, so I'm like, no, like, I, I don't care, um, I'm like that's that's not great. Like I don't want to I don't want to do that. So yeah, like dude, they were supposed to have that this whole month with the little the the tag there, and it's only just now working. Like that would have been so nice to like see visually having the tag there. God, it's annoying. But no, that that'd be great. Uh, be be just like a secret millionaire. That'd be awesome. Should be good. Yeah, yeah, he's dead. Have a bad, yeah. That's that's like the ideal, I think for for who wouldn't want that? Yeah. Oh, and garlic bread. I pasta getty. I had, I've I've been eating leftovers because I make like a big batch of it. Is I could eat spaghetti every day and be very happy. Honestly, I I love the crap out of spaghetti. It is my favorite pasta, I believe. I, uh, I would have to say. I love the crap out of it. Ugh. So good. So good. Can't go wrong. And the sauce I made to go with it, like, oof, it's like spicy. A little, little bit spicier than I, I intended it to be. <laughs> but it's so good at the same time.
I would have actually made some, uh, but I don't have any bread. Well, any fresh bread. Like, I have a loaf of bread that's just, like, several, I don't even know how many months old sitting on the table. So I'm just like, it's hard, and I'm like, I'm not going to eat that. So I just haven't thrown it away. But I've got garlic, and I've got butter, and I can make some garlic bread. I just need bread. Just uh, butter it up, throw a little garlic on it, toss it in the air fryer, crisp it up a little bit. Oof, perfection. For the bread on the table. <laughs> I don't think it's quite that old. Tyson Mabrowski! What's up, man? With yeast, ye may rise again. Oh, I'm just, um, yeah, we are right. We're doing all right. Um, let's see. I don't think I had anybody say this was them, right? So I have no idea who this is. Uh, so we'll just uh, get rid of that. That was weird. Like that, I don't know why that showed up now. Like it reset yesterday. Um, look at that, Arena Wins is done. I need to open up some. Problem is, like, too much skill cats. There's no more arena I can do right now. Does anybody else want a, want a friendly? What am I chefing up? Uh, I'm not a big cook. I just cook for me. Though I do like having friends come over and like, like when something turns out like really good, I'm like, my friend, you gotta come over, you gotta try this because it's delicious. But um, But uh, now we, we can do like a couple friendlies now. We can just kind of chillax for a while. Friendlies, if anybody's down. We got 10 five stars in that game. I mean, I can, I can always shift around the, the deck too. It's not a big deal. Throw some lower champs in there. Though, like, I basically built, like, the topper end for, like, four, like, metas, like, so I probably couldn't make, like, very good deck for, with lower champions, probably, but. Dude, curry is delicious. I loved curry, too. Yeah, we can, um, two rank five ascended six star with Herc. Uh, let's see, you're in the victory, hold on, let me, um, so we, we can do this, we can, uh, go to this deck, clear the deck. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. So six star. I'll take, um, uh, two, two, only two rank fours. Oh, one star. Seven, seven, seven stars. Under 14. So two, two rank five ascended. 
We can uh, we can make this fair. Uh, I got I'll I'll leave Herc out of it. I want definitely want Hulk Queen though. Uh, shoot, I'll take Kingpin too actually. Uh, two two rank fours. Shoot, we'll you freaking use Silk. I love Silk. Um, I'll take take Spider Man. Um. I only, well, you said two. Your first message said you had two. Whatever. Uh, some seven stars. Uh, I imagine all your seven stars are rank one. Uh, so let's. I've got. I've got options here. We take a rocket. We'll take you. That's two. Uh, Wiccan's really good. That's three. Uh, four, five, six, uh, seven, uh, a couple rank fours. I did already add any rank. Did I already? No, I already added two rank fours. Uh, let's see. Um, while I'm sorting out the deck, you can just you can just send me a request, Tyson, and um, uh, let's see. So that's. So you rank threes maybe. I'll have with Elsa. I love my Elsa. Uh, we'll take you, you, uh, we'll probably get, uh, yeah, she, yeah, she'll, she'll be amazing. How many rank threes am I adding? That's four. Yeah, let me add like a fifth one. Oh, dude, I gotta have black cat in there. Hundred percent if I'm gonna have any of this. Okay. Uh, let's see. You said you had a like a bunch of five stars in there. Gotta have Nick. Doom, Onslaught, I mean, some of these are Ascended, but, yeah, uh, Tiger I will throw in there. Thank you, you're really good for this. Domino. It's the motion in the ocean, you're darn right. Uh, we gotta have the ham. Piggy. We'll throw a bullseye in there. Archangel. Venom, sure. The Korg. Magic. I have maybe a rank two six star that I would like. How about Kindred? Sure. Extra Defender. Alright. Use that deck. We'll have to uh, we'll have to change our loadout here. It's probably gonna screw things up. But uh, that's whatever. Set active. All right. Let's do it. Let's do it. Victor track uh, and the that one. Okay. Cool. Let's 
do it. So this is a significantly smaller deck. Um, it still might be bigger than what you got, but we'll we'll see. I we'll see what you got. Try try to make it at least somewhat fair. Uh, yeah, I still have the regular deck. I didn't change the other one. Uh, let's see. Oh, Juggernaut would be a good one, too. You got the CGR. I think I gotta get rid of the CGR. That's dangerous. Um, honestly, at these power levels, Torch probably kind of dangerous, too. Uh, uh, I put Silk in my deck, so I'm gonna leave it. Let's get rid of, uh, let's get rid of the Killmonger. Let's, <laughs> let's see what happens. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, Bobo. Silk. Let's take uh let's take Bullseye, sure. Go easy on it. Alright. Uh are we already friends, Penguin? If not, I don't have a spot for it, so Let's, uh, let's go and take Starkey. <laughs> kind of chilled is this? <laughs> yeah, you'll have to. Uh, my friends list is full right now, Penguin. So you'll have to. You'll have to give me a minute. I'll get that sorted. Uh... I get one more. And let's screw it. Let's take Viv. Why not? Let's do it. Use use some champs I like never play with. Uh, this will be great. Yeah, let's uh, see how you do with Bullseye. You've got some actually decent enough options. Yeah, like that's a really good option right there. Um, so this ought to be interesting. We'll see how this goes. I was a little slow. I suppose I could have used the, um, ooh, dude, that was actually a really nice takedown. Very nice. Solid. Sweet. Give you Terry. And we soak it. I happen to have him ranked up as a five star, so I was like, why not? Why not? 
Oh, wow, that's no great. All right, well, at least he's dead now, so. I, I botched that. <laughs> it's all good. Yeah, he did. He handled it great, honestly. Like, that's a really fun matchup to actually do. But it's super easy to mess up. Yeah, same. I've been, I've been parked. Yeah, so we're, we're, we're doing friendlies. Yeah, Tyson, that's not a great matchup because of the, the debuffs, but... Um, Wiccan would have been the option if he was awakened. Unawakened, like, Wiccan wouldn't be great for that, but... Um, would have been your best option for the... Yeah, that, I threw in the 7th star. Maybe that was a mistake. I could have used the 6th star. Uh, I was like, Defender, why not? Make it a big one. <laughs> Dead the deck shrunk. No. It's all good. Uh, yeah, let me... Uh... All right. Uh, just because I need the room, I'm going to go ahead and, and pop you off here. Uh, but uh, thanks thanks for the match, man. Uh, let's see. Who else can I get rid of? Who the heck is this? I have no idea who this is. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of this because I have no idea who it is. Let's see. Let's see. I have no idea. This, okay, let's go ahead and get rid of this one. Some of these, I just, I have no idea why they're on the list at all. Alright, that frees up a couple spots. Bengi! Alright, let's go. Let's do. Glad circuits and normal deck. So when he turned it off, bomb out of C6 on stream. Oh, ouch. That's rough. Did you rank three Domino Unduped? Oh my gosh. Bro. You have a solid deck, man. You need to get that Kushala ranked up. Kushala is fire. Uh, let's see. That is the question, ain't it? Where is Pengi at? See, I ranked two Killmonger unawakened, and he ended up never doing me all that well, as I was hoping. But then I duped him, so I was like, hey, great. It's fantastic. Uh, let's see.
Well, this is going to be interesting. This is going to be interesting. There's a photon. Bro. I think I think we go for the piggy wiggy here on the photon. <laughs> we just have to be very, very careful. Kept it up. Oh, that she didn't die! I thought that was gonna kill her! <laughs> Bro. That was terrible. Uh, if Trintinad MCOC. Sure, we can get a. We're, we're doing nothing else right now. We can get a friendly uh, in. That was terrible. <laughs> Um, uh, that was, uh, that was a bit on the rough side. Come on, Mojo, do your thing. Come on, throw it. Come on. Dude, I need you to. No. Frick. That was so bad. Dude, I need you to... <sighs> I'm getting the worst prompts. Oh, shoot. Like, there's nothing I can do. He wouldn't let me parry him. Twice. I'm gonna time out. Yeah, now I get a parry. Thank you. I... That should have been such an easy win. That was... That was terrible. Oh, brother. Yeah. 
Like, he would only meet a meet, which you can't parry. Uh, or he just wasn't dashing, you know? And I just... Was so much block damage trying to get a parry. And because I couldn't parry, I couldn't, like, heavy him to reset the prompt either. I was very unlucky. Uh, all right. Let's uh, see what you got. Sofa champions. Uh, mid Joe, yeah. Like I said, and he's extra boosted right now too. Me, not the me. Why such a weird sig level on the? On some of these champions. Yeah, yeah, dude, I hate getting clipped there. My guy, you banned my pig! How dare you! You jerk. That's, that's not great. Well, he doesn't need the, the Max Sig. He just needs the dupe Fury, really. Yeah, I do like the Sunspot. I need a better... Well, no, never mind. That's fine. Scratch that. We're fine. We'll be alright. We be alright. Oh, but we definitely want that. Let's do but yeah, I, I like the sunspot a lot. Ooh. All right, may the best RNG win this one. <laughs> Uh, I gave him too much power on that. Oh, that was my fault. I started out really good there, and I botched it. <laughs> uh... 
Yeah. If I didn't if I didn't mess up that and get hit that, I think I win that one. Cause that was like all my health there and that the mess up. Bummer. GG's. It's rather unfortunate. Alright, we gotta try this again. No, I can't do it that way. Fudge. You kind of put me in a corner, man. You kind of put me in a corner, and I don't like it. And, of course, I messed that up. Thank you. Missed my parry. Okay, he clipped me. What was that intercept, man? Easy win this one. And, uh, well, actually, no, I think I still lost that one. I already lost some health. GG's. Clean fight. That was terrible. I, I had all my luck um, come out uh, on Saturday. Apparently, that was that was a that was abysmal. <laughs> all right, have a good night, JJ. Thanks for uh, thanks for the raid earlier. Yeah, yeah, shut up. You want you want to go, Zode? You want to go? Let's let's go. Where are you at? Let's go. Uh, in arena. Psh, psh, ah. Boo arena. Exactly, Juan. We don't do that here, do we? <laughs> it's not like we do that here. Nah, that's good. Arena's important. It just eats up a lot of time, is all. Uh, Cam, yeah, Cam's in the alliance. Have you have you tried uh, Gladiator in the in this meta zone? Got rid of CGR. Bro. Bro. I wasn't going to bang later. Um, have you actually found him usable this meta? I, I should have taken Chavez. I have no idea what I'm thinking. Um... Fury SP2 do you ooh Ouch I will take Chavez this time.
mid combo. What? That's weird. Kind of wanted to take pig there, but like it wouldn't really do me much good. Um, yeah, intimidate is wonky. I think what we do. Bishop Fury, and hopefully it just uh, doesn't go terribly. Just be careful not to like mess up and get. Oh, dude, I lost like five seconds on the run in here. I need to restart the game. That was terrible. Can you throw that, please? Throw it so it falls off. Thank you. Bro, beautiful. Okay, every time. <laughs> it was slow anyway, but still. Yeah, it, it didn't matter. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll, I'll be doing 8.4. Um, I won't be able to do it day one, unfortunately. I have an appointment uh, on the 10th. That was sad. This is going to go poorly, I just know it. <laughs> this is not going to go great. This is going to be interesting. This one's going to be interesting, my guy. Come on. God, that does not crit. It does nothing. Come on. Oof, I'm glad that killed him. I mean, that wouldn't have killed him anyway, because it didn't crit. It didn't matter. That block damage is just 
With that Fury, man, the block damage is gross. If it wasn't for the Fury, the block damage would have been so much less. She's going to get ranked up. It's just a matter of time. That's all. Matter of time. See, you gave some SIGs to Domino. <laughs> Round three is going to be interesting, my friend. Uh, what's... What's SIG 20? What's up, Larson? You wouldn't throw specials? Yeah. It was taking so long at that point, it, uh... Like even if you didn't eat it, I think I, I think I had it. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> Let's do it. Prize on the line. I don't know. Domino just tends to mess me up. So let's uh, let's see what happens. Nope, that's not what we want. Oh, yeah, I tried to dex that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, we zoned in the zone! I was not realizing that. That was not, like, there are some skill champions that do domino fairly well. Masakre is not one of them. Um, in the slightest. Um, Juan, let's go. Let's do it. See, that's more like how my Saturday was going. Like, matches like that. Or sometimes just something happens, you know? Because sometimes it does. And there's like... <laughs> YOLO. And that block damage, dude. If he throws a special two, he hit that hits so hard into your block, it's not even funny. See what you got. 
Venom. I'll take that. I'll take that too. Let's see who the superior cosmic is, eh? Let's do this. I just need to not screw it up this time, because, like, I botched it last time heavily. Oh, I didn't restart my game either. Let me, let me do that after this um, match here. crits a little bit slow. That's a win! It's close, though. Venom sucks! No. Too slow, buddy. Still better RNG than I would have had trying to do with a Venom. Like, it never goes that well. I never get enough uh, crits for bleeds. Let's hopefully not get shafted. Dude, of course she evaded. And all my health is gone. Okay, dude, why was my spacing so far? That was dumb. Dude, every time I get clipped with Domino, it's exactly that. After I pushed over a bar of power and she has massive fury. See, that's just it, though. It's only one combo because of the, the fury. And she crits. Like, it literally doubled what damage she would have done. Like, I would have had half my health still if it wasn't for that Fury. Garbage. Garbages. But hey, what are you going to do? What you going to do?
Yeah, all the crits. GG's. I could have. I should have won that one. Domino. Domino's a dick, though. And that has nothing to do with her crit fail. Like, the damage from her crit fail. Like, her sig ability. Nothing to do with that. That's why, like, I... She's, like... Doesn't even matter. Like, the sig can be extra annoying, but, like, it's just Domino being a dick that that's problematic, you know? So... I don't know. How did I know you were going to put Longshot on D? Longshot's a dick! Can't do 29 seconds, though. <laughs> My only hope there was that you, you know, you'd mess that up on the rotation, but that was literally, literally my only hope. Because I couldn't have killed, I couldn't have killed Longshot if I put Photon on D. That was a clean fight, though. I mean, that was what, 40, 49k? Not fifty one K, sorry. Like that was that's a good score. Where's your plus sixteen? <laughs> uh, sorry, not here. I'm getting clapped by all the friendlies now. But we beat two FNAFO. DTX DTX I need a rematch with DTX. DTX, you want to rematch? <laughs> Are you in here? I need to rematch DTX. I need to rematch. Um, while you're thinking about that, I'm going to get myself some more to drink. I'll be back. Ugh. Be honest though, that was a perfect photon versus long shot fight. Like it couldn't have gone any better. 
too much info on the champ champions after the update. I it doesn't. I don't think it bothers me. I think it's kind of interesting. I don't mind it at all. Gotta get the objective tokens. Yeah, I would like to, but like I can't match anybody. I really can't. Like we're we're in twentieth position right now. Um, twenty first again. Okay, so somebody came back above me. I I, I went to twentieth. Like on Sunday, and then yesterday I was back in 20th, and now I'm in 21st, so. Uh, just above Shred. Shredness. Yeah. So I, I have actually, whoops. Uh, I need to burn this energy out real quick. Uh, I think it's still buggy, though. Um, but I want to test, like, somebody said, like, just restarting the game fixes it. So let's see if that is accurate. Like, I refresh, please. Oh, my gosh. Zap is weird. So let's see if that did, in fact, actually fix it. No, that did not fix it. That's really annoying. So that that's really annoying that it it's it's straight just doesn't function properly. And it bugs out and you have to reset the whole mastery uh, setup. That's that's great. It's lovely. That needs to get fixed way sooner rather than way later. Thankfully, we're using champs like it legit doesn't matter. Because like this should be ticking for almost a thousand damage, but it says only me ticking for like six hundred, which means I am missing out on sixty percent attack. So, yeah, it's, um, it's rather unfortunate. It's really annoying. So I can't, I can't be switching the masteries around no more. It's just wasting a bunch of time having to reset it. I think it, it feels like it's like it just specifically like a recoil offensive mastery tree thing though because everything else seems to be working fine, right? Like I'm still getting my parry. Um, I still have Dex. Obviously, Dex is still working. Like Dex is still like we have parry. If you would uh, attack me. Dude, I hate the passive AI. Get out of here. Unbelievable. Either way. It's really dumb, really annoying, and buggy, and I hate it.
Like, this is the annoyance of doing masteries, is, like, how long it takes to just place points back in. Friendly? Yeah, give me, uh, give me a second. I just need to burn some energy here. We'll see. I've, I'm not playing, like, amazing. Although that last fight was actually perfect. I just... I The draft was out of my favor, so... And that should fix everything back up to normal. And that's where things should be. Anyway. Let me just burn a little bit more of the energy here and we're going to be fine. Just let it finish out the map and it'll be good. Ugh. Anyway. Gladiator is solid. I really like him. Yeah, Destroyer is like super cool. But I don't think he's going to be top, top class like Serpent is right now. Like offensively or defensively. Uh, Spider Punk's probably gonna go crazy high because of the new mechanics and just he's super cool. Um, he's probably gonna be one of the higher ones. Prowler, I don't know. I feel like the the hype is more on Spider Punk than Prowler right now. So we'll we'll see. I'm certainly more like enthusiastic about Spider Punk because I want to get my hands on him. Really looks super fun. I want to have a I want to have a mess about him. Yeah, the science class is pretty busted. Mystic Mystic defenders. There's very few like good Mystic defenders. Like Sassy's up there just. And basically only because his health pool is just so big, and he's tanky. Like that's like the only reason. He's a, he's a top BG player too. Like I th last I saw, he's in C4, isn't he? But yeah, Sassy is one that's like almost requires you have a science to really do particularly well. Um, uh, science is really, really great for Destroyer, but because you can dex this special 2 pretty easily, like, it's punishing if you mess it up, um, but he's, he's, I don't think he's that bad. Destroyer is kind of weird, though. Yeah, I mean, he's usually in, like, C4. Hey, we got our units. That's the last of the units we're going to get for this uh, event. Well, for sure, because it ends tomorrow, so yeah. Alright, Zero, send it over. Send it. Getting my, hand, my butt clapped here by all these guys, though. We beat Judah, though, and his deck is stacked.
All right, yep, there's that rank three unduped. Personally, I'm gonna get rid of the hood because hood is dangerous. Oh, you have another. You, you have enough, another. If you rank four is in there. Hey, yours is also Sig 100. What do you know? Oops. Yeah, I timed out. Dag nab it. That wasn't what I wanted. That's annoying. You ranked three Gladiator? As a seven star? Infinity duo. Yeah, we'll see. Is it a six star? I was gonna say, I was like, eh. Six star rank threes, they don't really matter. They done a matters. We have very similar drafts. <laughs> this was like the rotation is like identical for Hulkling. Like it never changes. So like it's really just a matter of the AI at the at that point. Okay, why would you throw that? You dick face. It didn't really slow me down all that much. That was stupid, though, man. <laughs> what was that? Stupid special one. That was so stupid. You shouldn't have thrown that special. That was bogus. It was bogus. Garbo. Garbo. Well, what are you going to do? Oh. Yeah, Bishop does that really well. <laughs> I was hoping to get to us, like, just nuke it anyway. 
and not need to get to the anyway. Anyway. GG zero, we did in fact two owe it. Easy. You want to take a crack, Lorson? <laughs> a brick wall. <laughs> uh. I drafted pretty well. We had fairly similar drafts, but I had the better counters. I mean, I think that was partly your fault for trying to do the mirror match with me, with Nick Fury. I'm pretty confident in my Nick Fury abilities, especially with that particular matchup. And Nick Fury is like a pretty set length of time. Like, you know how long a Nick Fury fight is going to take. You shouldn't have tried the mirror matchup. You should have uh, should have given me somebody else. Result. All right, let's do it. You're in GC getting wrecked. <laughs> Dude, I was getting wrecked until I until Saturday. Dude, I was getting slapped all over the place. What happened? It wouldn't let me. It wouldn't let me do it. There we go. I didn't want to. Did we do it? There we go. That was weird. I mean. Probably. Um. All right. Yeah. Get rid of this, this guy, man. It's so dangerous. Yeah. Sixty points down still. Four hours more tomorrow. Eesh. That's so sketchy to do in the final couple hours, though, man. So sketchy. Yeah, I would say titanium between the two, 100%. 100%. It's over. You sold! Alright, I need somebody for that serpent, because serpent's a... Okay, that works. <laughs> like, because serpent's a dick. Just a feeling Healing, you are my healing, healing me, you're healing me in me. Yeah, black hat is whew, filthy, filthy. Ooh, the black cat for Sassy. Good luck with that. 
I was not expecting that. And on the inside. Just a feeling. My healing. Let me. And the inside <clears throat> Am I healing? Am I healing? Yeah, you did Data Grow Singer, yeah. Sounds of satisfaction. Yeah. Uh, Venom good on D. Um, he can be. Like he's so aggressive. Like he can be very annoying. That went surprisingly somewhat better-ish. I think maybe possibly though. I don't know. I know Black Hat can do that, but like she slowed down significantly this meta. She's a she's a truck, uh, Zero. She hits really hard. She can take stuff down pretty dang quick. That's so been back but the enemy so yeah ground me so good. Uh, just in case, we're doing this. <laughs> I'm like, I could just go for the win here, but just in case. I w I'm curious round three. We're going to do it this way. To be fair, last time I tried Chavez versus this matchup, I got wrecked. So, oh my gosh. Oh, her light reach. Garbage. Dude, can you please? Dude, I was trying to... That light punch, man. Oh my gosh, you dick. You think I'm throwing? Just just watch. Just watch. Just watch. I know exactly what it is I'm doing. Any timed out. Well, that's because he needs ability accuracy, and all the glancing was a fun bait. <laughs> yeah. I definitely should have won that. Depending on how my fight goes, though, it will 
determine how well this actually is, but... So, like, I can still win this, but... See how it goes. See how it goes. Ouchie. Okay. That was, uh, that was terrible. God zoned <laughs> Yeah. That would have been tough for me to be. Like, it could have, but I, I freaking hate. I freaking hate that. The stagger could have gotten shrugged or something. Yeah, I, I, I should have just gone for the win here. Like, you didn't really have a good Fury option. I should have just chop as this fight. But then I was definitely screwed round three if I didn't win it. So, I was like, anyway. It's worth the try. Yeah, exactly. We just having fun with it. Let's see, Lorson. Did you want to? Did you want to try a uh, try one? Like if that was a ranked match, I like for sure would have just gone for the win. I hate Serpent, man. Serpent's like the bane of my existence to fight. In a match, all right. Fair enough. Uh, Ghost is not Ghost isn't in here, is he? Or Nugget? How many does that take? Because I've had like four of the first one before, and still, like, taking massive chunks of damage. So like I I don't I don't even get that. Sure, we can we can do another one zero. I think I still got a a bit before my uh, my champs are off cooldown to use again. Yeah, I still got. It's, they're they're about to refresh, but they're not off it yet, so we can do another match first. On the sleeping pills. <laughs> yeah. Getting walking free. Uh, 
think I waited too long in this last time, didn't I? I did. I definitely didn't want to fight. Just because of the meta. Like, if it wasn't for the meta, I would definitely fight an un unduped one. But, like, this meta is garbage for it. It's up, like, 20 points a day? Dang. Alright, well, Serpent banned, so let's take, uh, let's take, uh, Mantis. points. Ouch. Walking, walking, free. Top 20 C6. I was top 20 C5. Ooh, that's a huge fever. Dang. Bro. That's, that's rough. That's like super rough. I need to be able to get to my special two and then he's dead. If we can't pull that off, we're going to be hurting. Um, so we're going to have to... We're going to have to... Um, I could have done that faster. Uh, let's see. Handy clapped. <laughs> All right, Larson. You can do one after that. Oof, that was close, though. It's close. Too slow, though. Okay, can you not do that, please? Frickin' garbage! Well, so much for this match. Like, that could not have gone any worse for a, for a start.
Yeah. <laughs> we still got it. <laughs> oh, GG, zero. <laughs> um. Oh, man. Uh. Uh, what's up, Charlin? Game seems to be a lot more fast right now? Mm, I don't know about that. Uh, I thought you were going to have me on that. After after the start I had anyway. Like, it was like, it was possible if I had like a clean run. That was so bad. Oh, it was so bad. Uh, I can't believe, like, he just kept glancing, wouldn't let me intercept him, and I got to a special three before I even did 10% of his health. Yeah, dude, they're both, they're both goaded. Uh, Lorson, you wanted to, you want to try one? Yeah. You can do that before we hit the battlegrounds, back, or hit up the arena back. Yeah, Chavez, Chavez is insane. Crazy that I just haven't been drafting um, Maestro at all, just because he gets clapped so easily by so many champions that are just, like, super prevalent. Yeah, with the Fury, yep. That'll immediately tank. Oh, dude, anybody with that Fury will just clap all of your health immediately. Super annoying. Shepherd, follow all my days. And sweeter, let me break away Do valley, let her leave me alone Lead on, good shepherd, lead on I step day by day, lead me on, Lord, I pray We do day by day Good shepherd, we pass step day by day. Lay me on, Lord, I pray. And by free. Lost harder. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my days. Do you sing 55? Bro. That just ain't fair. Uh, botched it. nice if Domino can play some ball. That would be, uh, that'd be great. Okay, dude.
I was not winning it anyway. Gamar's turn. I gotta, I gotta hit up the arena back. Gotta hit the arena back. Now, he doesn't have a lot of abilities to fail, so, like, you're not going to be triggering it much anyway. Um... And if you're fighting a 7-star Domino, the the energy damage isn't going to be that high between the class um, disadvantage and... Uh, well, it's it scales off a base and run anyway, so... Then go with me, long I'm gonna walk. Then go with me, still I will follow. Then go with me, gonna walk, I'm gonna walk. Go with me, still I will follow. Yeah, again, like, there's not a whole lot of abilities to fail, so. Like, it's better that he has it for the, the energy resistance. He'll take even less, but, yeah, it's not. That one was my fault. That was terrible. Unlimited unstoppables. Yeah. So much unstoppable. All the unstoppable. I messed that up. For the love of God. GG's, Larson. To be fair, to be perfectly honest, I did not realize I had my evade counter back. <laughs> Otherwise, that would have been way more safe to just finish that fight out. Fine, it's still early. Let's 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 do it. One more.
Beat me if you can, good bar. Beat me if you can. We've had we've had several people beat me tonight though. Tiger on D! <laughs> Tiger could be a dick. She's kind of crazy. Pass pacificity is what made that one bad. Usually it's aggressiveness that uh, causes a problem there. Oof. Ouchie. Ouchie, mama. Yeah. And then they wait for the neutralized to fall off, and then they throw it, and then you have to wait out the buffs, and you just get more, par uh, more power because you're dexing, you can't parry because of the buffs, yeah. It's annoying. You got two really nice uh, rank threes there. I just really don't like Korgs. I really don't. <laughs> Whale tech. <laughs> uh, does it look bigger seeing it with like all the actual stats so you can see what's in there? Like, come on. You say that now, Zode, but like the scores are moving. Well, I mean, there's there's half a day, a little over half a day. You're probably fine. You're probably fine. Let's be honest. Uh, yeah, sure you can do fam. I mean, a lot of champs can do fam. It's more AI problematic than anything else. Um... Maestro to play ball. Otherwise, we lose. Good start.
Freaking stand your ground. It's terrible. Yeah, good fight. Uh, I do not like fighting Serpent. He just never cooperates with me. Literally ever. We got wrapped to match. Bro. Okay. That's no good. So bad. Why did I do that? That was so stupid. That slowed me down so stupidly much doing that. I botched this so hard.
That was so bad. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, probably got it, though, if it's not already over here, though. Yep. GG's, Gabar. You got yourself in a corner with that. Very nice. Yeah, that, that, that matchup does work, but I don't know if you could have pulled it off particularly well with, uh, no, you still could have pulled it off, I think, but yeah, I also shouldn't have thrown a special one for whatever reason I did, which made me waste like a stupid amount of time. Uh, the stats? What was with the... Ooh! So close! <laughs> you got hit with the crit uh, uh, the sp after a special one. Yauchi. If my fight had gone the way it should have gone, though, I don't think he would have had a chance. But given that I messed it up, you definitely could have won it. Yeah, you went, you went for the, like, the full big ramp up. Three oh seven. Oof, filthy. Guilty. Let's see. The three percent. <laughs> yeah, you nearly died. You pause here. Pause here. Filthy pause here. Got your win back, and you're done. Good. <laughs> just, just hold it on, to Hold it on. Every time with the stupid things. <laughs> Worth it. Gained one point. <laughs> it's too stressful for one point gained, man. Oh, man. Very nice. You're slipping away, yeah. It's it it'd be like that for sure. Like especially in the final, you know, hours of the people trying to get those last minute climbing in, you know. Like people are just like, eh, I don't want to play, but like, nope, I will push this little bit to just get a final placement, and they do, and it's like.
yeah. It's pretty pretty wild. Knew I was getting clipped there on that dash. Oof, that was close. Sketch. One match for the night. Nice. I I didn't worry about the sub objectives this time because I was like, I'm holding C5 this time. I'm not doing the same thing I did last season. Do the... Well, it wasn't actually the, the final objectives that, that cost me the C5. It was the drop I had on, on Saturday that cost it me. Because if I had stopped where I peaked at, I would have been C5 last season. But no, we didn't. We kept playing and ended up playing a crap ton just to barely make C6. It was miserable. Last season was so miserable. I had a couple rough times this season, but it was nothing like the, the final few days of last season. That was so stressful, man. M1 it is, yeah. It's a big difference, though. I mean, I've M M1 to C5 is 20k tokens, which is substantial. But, uh, yeah. And the trophy tokens are too valuable to uh, not get as many as possible. It's like we get a lot every season uh, from the victory track and the the alliance milestones and then the placement. Like it's it's sizable. So I think it's what, like twenty twenty five thousand. After at the beginning of a season for winning for playing your five matches, right? Um, yeah, that's pretty fun. Um, and then the alliance, like the remaining milestones, give you another quite a big chunk. The alliance milestones give you another big chunk, and then wherever you place, plus then ten thousand as well from the. Uh, Alliance Placement. I think it's Alliance Placement that gives you the extra 10k ers. Pretty sure. So, I mean, you can get more than like a, a full cap of inventory worth a season. I'm curious. I'd have to double check the numbers of like guaranteed amounts and then placement amounts. I'll have to double check. I would have to look. But we'll see. So I'll take my 10k extra from being in C5 and not C6 over the 1200 for the objective reset. As much as I want to do it, like I just I can't risk it. Like it's too stressful to play in the final hours if I'm not like pushing for a spot. Um. So it's just not okay. It's not okay. If I was an M1, sure, I would do it because I'd be pushing Celestial. But, like, already being as high as in Celestial as I'm going to get, like, no, it's just not going to happen. Not happening. Ain't going to have it happen.
It's the April Fool's, like, just kind of fun thing they, they launched. Just, it's just for a title, basically. Basically all it's for. Nothing crazy. Fights don't take too much effort and doesn't cost any energy, so it's like, even though it's kind of stupid, like you just kind of go in circles. The like I don't know, I I spent maybe like an hour doing it, <laughs> just because I had a couple uh, between the fights and then getting like stuck in a loop for like half an hour. At least it felt like it was that long. There's actually, if you guys haven't seen this, there's actually a funny interaction. With Voodoo and Iron Man. Because, like, his special one converts all buffs. Uh, into poisons, but his armor ups are uh, immune to that. This Iron Man's gonna die before he can actually get it off, guys, isn't it? I want to get him. I want to get him alive. There we go. So it'll convert them all to poison, but like the armor don't go away, <laughs> so he still has the buffs. Anyway, I'm not sure if that, that's probably potentially a bug. But I'm not 100% certain. I'd have to look at the wording of Voodoo. Really? 1%? Uh, in fact, I'm actually going to look that up right now. It's, it's probably a bug, but like... All right, special one. The chance to envenom the buffs. Nullifying it. See, that's interesting, because the way that's worded, it doesn't sound like a bug. But you can't poison via the Loa buffs anybody that's immune to nullify. Because Iron Man isn't, like, specifically nullify immune, which is why you can at least nullify the Loas. But his armor ups are immune to. Uh... Where is OG Iron Man? Uh, armor ups. Let's see. Cannot be removed by nullify effects. Okay, so they're not actually immune to nullify. They're just not removed via trying to be nullified. So actually, it doesn't sound like a bugged interaction. It's just an interesting interaction. So, like, they're nullified, but they aren't removed via... It's like, similarly, like, um, Nimrod, like, armor break generally removes armor, but Nimrod doesn't remove his armor. So, like, it, it sounds like it's coded the same way, so... It's just an interesting interaction. Anyway... Bug in this game? No way, not a chance, right? Yeah. I still haven't made a post about um, some of the other stuff that's been happening in the last few days with like war and stuff, have they? They haven't addressed it yet, as far as I know.
Uh, let's have a look see. They didn't er as of earlier when I was looking, but doesn't appear so. I don't know. Again, I don't like the forums. Like, nothing that's, like, seemingly important is ever, like, up in front. When they, like... Like, whenever they announce something specific, like, it's, like, on the, the rotator, but... Like, if they... Make, like, a... What I would say a sizable, like, note of something important, it doesn't necessarily get popped up there. I don't know. It's just annoying. Yeah, we're generally plagued by a lot of bugs. Oh, I have to spend the currency, too, before I forget. I haven't spent any this week. Yours, I'm yours, I'm yours, I'm yours. Ah, couldn't get an in fast enough, he would have died so much sooner. It's better to be up a full match, though, Lorson, as well, rather than just, like, back and forth and only being, like, one or two points ahead or below or just... I, mean, I guess breaking even is not that bad, but, like, it's, like, feels so bad to, like, do it and only be up, like, points instead of matches. Yep. So... Uh, 88.1 88 for me, but yeah. Good stuff right there. How many Elder Marks do you have right now you've been sitting on? Are you capped out? Well, you shouldn't be capped. You should always be, like... Max you want to have ending the season with is, like, 7,000 because your ca the cap is 9 and you get 2,200 when you do your matches. So if you have more than more than that than you could use when the next season starts. That's a bad thing. You should never end a season with more than 77,000. Uh, season 18. You get more than that in like two seasons. So like... Like, we get over 5,000 for free between the milestones and the alliance stuff. So, like, you could well, well easily hit cap in, in by just not using them for a couple seasons. It's just a PSA more than anything, I guess. Uh... 
that you never actually want to be at cap when the season ends because you're wasting a lot. Ugh, they don't bush. Yeah, yeah. I got you. Ooh, I actually got the end there. I thought I was going to get clapped. Thought I was getting clapped. Yeah. Like, push through the region. We're close to 2.5 million battleships. Dang. You, the darkness sighs, darkness sighs. Come on, you boy. Let's see, who is going on right now? This is finished, so that was buggied out. Daytime Abido doing arena. Oh, Legacy's uh, doing some final BG. Oh, I gotta pull this up real quick. He was a little bit below me last I saw. But I thought he was C5, though. I thought he was... Uh... This meta's rough, though, man. He's watching his playback here. Uh, getting sidestepped by a stupid photon. Dude. Like every time. Oh, man. Getting clapped. Clutched it though. Yeah, he's at 340. Did he drop a little bit? I thought he was higher than that. He's pushing it though. The man's pushing it. Probably, uh, probably call it after this one, this run here. Ugh. Should probably go over to the store, pick up a couple things I need. Yeah, still, still nothing yet. I imagine we'll get it sometime the, by the by the weekend, which doesn't give us a lot of time to work with before the next season starts. But uh, who knows? I just hope when they do announce it, they'll announce the the next two at the same time. Um, like I feel like they should give us like a week at least notice. Um, you know, like, so, like, they announced the next meta, like, before the the previous season ends, so we have, like, that, that full, like, time to f decide what we want to do. But, um... 
for rank ups and such. But I, I think part of it is it's going to have something to do with the next saga, and they haven't announced the next saga yet either. Like what the what the champ buff is and stuff. Uh, so that could be potentially part of it, maybe. If I'm just spitballing here, though. Just spitballing. Barely got it. And then we usually see rewards Friday. We'll have we'll have a seven star to open, which would be cool. Uh, we'll still open up the basic. I'm not going to open up a Titan, though, with um, EOP tomorrow. That'll be fun. We'll, we'll be able to finish up the EOP tomorrow. That's cool. Um, do all those objectives. There should supposed to be have some leeway, so we'll, we'll see about that stream. Um, we're going to be basically done with arenas. Uh, so we don't have to, we won't, I won't have to deal with any arena probably that stream. We'll just straight EOP. Uh, which would be nice. That's will be good. Um, so we'll have that tomorrow. But we won't be able to open up the Titan, because that one we're waiting on. I'll have to wait a week. A bit unfortunate. A bit sad. I'm curious, though. I'm betting I'll actually be able to open up two. Because um, we'll, have, we'll have one. Because um, we already have half, and we're getting like a full um, like a full one from EOP there's like 15 like no I guess it's only no, I would need 15,000 more shards um, never mind I don't know if, I mean it's it's not impossible for Act 8 to give 15,000 Titan shards is it? Is that is that an unreasonable ask to give to give that many Titan shards for a Titan? I don't think so. Also needs to give like a reasonable amount of seven star shards too. At least in the hundred percent. I don't know. We'll we'll see what the rewards are looking like. See what rewards are looking like. We'll find out uh, in a week, so. Too bad I can't do it all. Well, I wouldn't. I probably wouldn't do it all, all anyway. Um, so yeah, I'll, I'll finish off the four-star arena today. Because these will reset, and I'm going to do them a little more anyway. Won't be bad. I'm looking forward to it though. So the, the, the next two milestones are actually going to sit uh, for the time being. It's rather unfortunate actually. Because um, I don't want to claim them yet either. Because I I want to because I want to see what I'm going to need for the T the T six as well. 
and that's two full T6 selectors in those milestones as well. So I'm going to like do the points, but I'm not going to be able to claim them uh, until I'm ready to figure out which which class I want to take, which will depend on A.4. So I'm going to have to hold on to them for a week uh, and a bit to decide. Dang, slightly unfortunate. That is slightly unfortunate. Just slightly. Bummer. Oh well, what are you gonna do? What you gonna do? Yeah, I might head over to the store and pick up a couple things, maybe. I need an onion. What else do I need? I could pick up some more canned veggies, too. I knew that was going to happen. Like, I knew I wasn't going to be able to do that. Oh well, yeah, let me just cancel my heavy. Can't do it with that animation. Can't do it. You cans. Can't do it. Bummer. Bummer. That is one long bum hair. Okay. Alrighty, I think that's gonna do it for me for today, though. Um you guys want to pop it whoa jeez okay jeez remember that um check over on legacy doing a final celestial push hit trying to go for c5 it looks like so if you want to pop in over there show him some love and support cool dude uh, but uh thank you guys for a good stream some just chilling doing some friendlies having a bit of fun and uh I will see y'all around tomorrow. We got the new EOP, so we're going to knock that out, hopefully, and uh, have ourselves a bit of fun. But until then, peace out, and I'll see you guys around. Have yourselves a great night. Peace.